One from celebrities to superstar athletes and to gold medal winners. 2012 London Olympic Games. This is Bria Larson. And did you know that she is an Arizona native, actually a Mesa native, which I, anyone from Mesa, I like to like just claim full responsibility. So oh, absolutely. you absolutely. are incredible. I have loved hearing your story and listening to how you really have this drive for swimming, but you say that that's really alive in a lot of these athletes. Oh, absolutely. I honestly think that when they have this obsessive goal, they're really able to go on and do whatever they want to. And you think of any other occupation out there, if you find they have that obsessive athlete drive, they're really going places. But I think it really has to come from within. I think when you're working, especially with younger athletes, you have to help train them to get to that mentality, but you can't force it. See, and I thought that was so interesting because you work with a lot of young athletes and you see some of these parents who are pushing those kids towards whatever the goal might be. But that wasn't the case with you. That was just you, who you were. Absolutely. Um, I mean, my coming from a family of seven kids, yes. you know, we, I got a seventh of the attention and had to share all of it. And so that was probably one way for me to try and get more attention, honestly, yeah. um, like looking back at my child psychology. Yeah. Um, but really, it's I, I wanted to do something different. I wanted to do something special. And even from a really young age, I wanted to go to the Olympic Games and cartwheels in the front yard don't always cut it. So I had to kind of try. She a wanted of to be sports. an Olympic gymnast, everyone. How tall are you again? I'm six feet tall. Yeah, six feet tall. Hey, you know, <laughs> Sean Johns is a little bit shorter than that. For people who are going to be coming to the Valley this weekend, I mean, you are born and raised here. You're back now and you're giving back to the community. What do you hope that they take away from the community here? Honestly, I think just enjoying the outdoors. I think it's really easy to be active and have a lot of fun here. And especially right now in the age of like social media, like put your phone down and get outside. Go do something fun. <laughs> and you are teaching swimming, aren't you? Oh, I do a lot of swim lessons, and I work with all ages, and I love doing a special kind of twist and making sure I add in the psychological point of view and really help their brain understand how to train because the psychology part of, of any sport is so important, and so I love incorporating that into my lessons. Okay, psychology-wise, mm -hmm. when you are about to compete for an Olympic gold medal mm -hmm. and these people who are doing the Super Bowl, best mm -hmm. tip? Best tip? It's the same every day. So with swimming, like the field's just as long, the grass is just as green. This is the same opportunity as any other meet so or any other competition. <laughs> Maria, you are incredible. <laughs> Cannot believe that you are born and raised Mesa. It's just fantastic. Gold medalist Bria Larson. We're back with more right after this quick break.